Here's the updated winter weather briefing. At 5 p.m., we've got winter weather advisories across southeast Minnesota and southwest Wisconsin. This includes Perdusheen, Wisconsin, also Rochester, Minnesota, and also Austin, Minnesota. Further to the southwest, there's a winter storm warning, and this covers much of Iowa, including northeast Iowa. Both the advisories and warnings are for heavy snow that will be moving across the area quickly this evening. Meanwhile, further to the north, we're looking at a wind chill advisory, which affects Clark and Taylor, and we're looking at wind chill values of anywhere from about minus 25 to minus 35 for late tonight into Tuesday morning. Here's the expected snow accumulations this evening. As we said, it will be quickly moving across the area with 3 to 6 inches of snow uh, falling in the Austin, Charles City, and Platteville areas. And as you move quickly to the north, uh, these snow totals will quickly dissipate with only maybe a dusting to a couple tenths of an inch by the time you get to Medford, Wisconsin. As far as impacts, for tonight, we're looking at medium to high, and this will affect southeast Minnesota, northeast Iowa, and southwest Wisconsin. And this will be mainly due to slippery roads caused by snow. Looking at the radar, we're looking at snow quickly moving into the area. By the time we get towards 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, snow will be quickly spreading into western Wisconsin. And by 9 o'clock, heavy snow will be falling across northeast Iowa and southwest Wisconsin. Early snowfall rates could be up to an inch an hour uh, from throughout much of the evening across these areas. Then as we get towards 11 o'clock, snow will be quickly tapering across the area. And by midnight up to 1 a.m., we're probably east of the area. So looking at things, we're looking at snow spreading across the area quickly this evening, accumulation rates of one inch per hour with the heaviest snow, and this would be most likely across northeast Iowa. Plows could have trouble keeping up with the snow, especially across northeast Iowa. Road conditions will deteriorate quickly, and travel will be impacted for the evening commute and anyone else traveling during the evening. Besides the um, snow, we also have expecting bitterly to dangerous wind chills heading into the weekend. Some of the coldest wind chills are expected on Wednesday morning where we could see wind chills of minus 35 to minus 40 for northeast Iowa, southwest Wisconsin, and north of I-94 in Wisconsin. So that looks to be a thing. And also that will be our coldest day where high temperatures in many locations may not even get above minus 5. When your wind chill values are minus 20 to minus 40, frostbite can occur in 10 to 20 minutes. And when you're uh, colder, uh, approaching about minus 40, uh, frostbite can occur in less than 10 minutes. Summary points. Looking at snow heavy at times this evening. Snow will exit quickly uh, between 11 p.m. and 1 a.m. And there will be periods of bitter to dangerous cold late tonight through Saturday morning. Plan ahead for impacted travel and also dress for the cold. Thanks for listening.